Whoa, the lighting went so weird. What the heck? Come back, come back. Yo, the lighting was so nice just like a second ago. I don't know what just happened. Oh my god, why does it keep doing that? It literally, it looks so good and then I press record and it just gets all ugly. Oh my god, it keeps doing that, whatever. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Like and subscribe if you're a real one. Ah. Um, so today we're gonna do a quick get ready with me. I have to get ready super fast though, hence why this video is gonna have a more simple um, edit, I guess. And yeah, I'm just gonna go on a date with my boyfriend, KT, as you've seen in my previous videos. I'm not gonna do anything too crazy. I just wanted to try this out. I'm sure some of you may have seen this product. It's kind of like a hair curler and a hair dryer in one. I love to blow dry my hair with a round brush to get that blowout effect, but I've seen like a lot of people using something like this to kind of just do both things in one. And I have seen the Dyson one, but I'm not gonna spend whatever, is that like $600 or something? I'm not trying to spend that money. So we're gonna see if this is worth it. I think this is around like 20, it's either 20 to $40. It's pretty reasonably priced compared to the Dyson one. So we're gonna try this. We're gonna do my makeup, but yeah. I hope you guys enjoy. Let's get it. <laughs> So the first thing I like to do is my eyebrows. I don't do a whole lot on my complexion because my skin has changed a lot over the past couple of years and makeup just breaks me out. So I'm just gonna take a Q-tip and just go over my eyebrows just to get rid of any oil or moisturizer because I just find that it sits a lot better. So once that's done, I like to take my brow pencil. I'm using the, oh my God, I've always wanted to do this. I'm using <laughs> focus, bitch. Okay, um, my camera's broken, I guess. The It Cosmetics um, Brow Powerful. So I just take my spoolie, comb through. Oh, actually, first, before I forget, I like to put concealer on my eyelids just to even out the tone and act as a primer for my eyeshadow. And I actually, I don't wear makeup that often, which is crazy because anyone that knows me knows that I used to wear a full face like every freaking day. But like I said, my skin's changed. I just don't like how it feels on my skin anymore. I break out and I kind of like a little more natural look anyway. But I used to do like the full glam. I used to have like crazy yeah. eyebrows that almost met in the middle like, <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking, and my friends never told me that they looked bad, but whatever. Um, ciao. Anyway, so... <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna take this off now. It's kind of annoying me. Oh my god, my hair is like almost dry. I think I might have to blow dry it now. So I'm just brushing it out with this wide tooth comb. This is like the best for if you want to reduce like hair loss. I used to brush my hair with like just a normal brush. It would pull out so much of my hair. My brows are really cheesing me right now. I think I want to carve them out. One second. That was good enough, I guess. Whatever. Okay, so now we're gonna do the hair. So I like to part my hair and then I split the hair in half at the back and Okay, so first thing I already don't like is that it doesn't have like an on and off button. Oh, it does. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> I plugged it in and it was literally, it just started working on its own. But it has these labels on here. I just want it to focus on this. Can you just focus? Okay, I think it's focused, but it has these settings on here. So I'm gonna put it on 
low for now. I'm gonna mute myself so that you, you don't hear it. So that is the first bit of hair. I think I'm gonna use the cool setting just to set it. Okay, it's like, it's not bad. Cause normally when I do it with my round brush, it's a lot more curly, but okay, we'll try this side. Okay, so this is the hair. Um, I think it's okay. Normally when I use like a round brush and a hair dryer, I can get a lot more volume, but I think it, I just have to like, get used to using it. Uh, something I didn't like is sometimes this swivel cord wouldn't actually swivel. Like it takes a bit of pressure to get it moving. So that was like the thing I didn't like. And then also getting into my roots was kind of tricky. So I think this is something that I would have to use after I do like a quick blow dry with my regular hair dryer. But other than that, my hair does look healthy. I only used the low setting. I didn't use the high setting because when I used the high, it started to smell like it was burning and I don't like that smell. So that's another thing. Overall, would I buy it? I don't know yet. I kind of want to see how long this lasts. I don't use any product on my hair. I don't use hair prote heat protectant, which I probably should. I don't use hairspray because that's going to crunch my hair and I don't want that. Um... Eh, it's okay. So right now I'm gonna finish my makeup. We're just gonna do eyeshadow, eyeliner, and lashes, and then we're basically done. So let's get it. So I'm gonna be, should really silence my phone. I'm gonna be using Naked Heat palette. I've used this so much. As you can tell, you can't even see, like it's all scratched off. I have to hurry up because I'm running a little late. <laughs> Talking and filming and getting ready it takes a lot longer than I thought, but I'm just gonna Okay, so that's pretty much it and now I'm gonna curl my lashes I pinched my eyelid the other day like I was just in such a rush and it hurt so bad Yeah, actually I definitely would love to do a more in-depth um, makeup tutorial because I do have a few tips that I would love to share Ow, fuck. I just pinched myself, see? I cannot do this while I'm in a rush. There we go, they're all curled. So I like to take like a dark brown liner for my inner corners and sorry, I can't get up close to the camera because I definitely need the mirror for this. I don't know why, I, I just like how I look in this mirror and then I see how I look in the viewfinder and I'm just like, that looks like two totally different people. And then I do the other side. I don't know about you guys, but I think that what really makes or completes the makeup look is lashes and oh, these literally just broke. That's totally okay. You know why? Because I have like eight other pairs just like it. Bomb. I actually, I don't even, I hate how my hair is right now. Like I hate it. I feel like it's just like ruining my look. Like maybe doing my hair this way was not the move. Oh my gosh, I didn't curl like one of the lashes on or like a chunk of lashes on this lash. No, it just looks stupid. Like, look at that. You can see the, oh, whatever. Okay, so now that all the makeup and hair is done, I don't know, I might do something else to my hair, but now that we're done the hair and makeup, I have to figure out what to wear, which is like my least favorite part, but yeah, I'll throw something on. I'll be right back. So this is the dress I would have loved to wear today, but it's literally, yeah, that's what it looks like outside. <laughs> so I just wanted to try it on because I bought this about a year ago and my weight has fluctuated quite a bit. 
and I just want to make sure it still fit me, but this is what I would have loved to wear today, but I can't. <laughs> so we're gonna try out something else. Because I was rushing so much, I now have extra time, so we're gonna find something else to wear. So this is what I'm wearing. I feel like I might change into some mom jeans. I don't know, I kind of want to like eat a lot. <laughs> so let's change into some mom jeans. So I completely went against my first plan, but I just, I tried on like, I don't know, like 10 different outfits and I just was not liking it. So, I'm, and I have a freaking hole. I have worn this shirt before, I think, in one of my videos, so whatever, don't come for me. <laughs> and I'm just wearing some jeans. Ooh. Ew, my feet. But I think I might change my jeans before I go. I just don't know what jeans to wear yet, but I'm actually tired. I don't even want to go out anymore. I just want to, like, be in bed. <laughs> I don't know if you guys have ever gone through that where you're just like trying on so many different outfits It's actually exhausting and all your energy went into that and now you don't want to do anything, but um, Yeah, ignore this freaking hole. My other turtleneck is in the wash. So this is what I have to deal with um, Yeah I kind of just want to cry I'm very annoyed.